I was watching Blue Planet the other day, and I was really stoned, and I was just thinking like, there must be so much like ocean drama that occurs that like no one ever hears about. You know, like when like David Attenborough manages to catch like an awesome thing happening under the water, like that probably happens every day in the ocean, but like we never know about it. It's like traffic jams and that kind of thing. Wow, this guy. What is this? What is this? Charlie XCX and I'm at the Brighton Sea Life Centre. Oh my god, stingrays. This is so crazy. They look really bored. They're not very happy that enemies come to interview them. Look at his face, he's so happy. Ah! I love sharks. Like, literally, they blow my mind. I've loved, like, really terrible shark movies. Like, there's um, this one called Sharknado with Tara Reid, who's like an epic actress in my book. Josie and the Pussycat, she was in that, killer. And also, uh, Sharktopus, it's pretty good. It's like half shark, half octopus. And there's just loads of boobs in that movie as well. There's always boobs. There's like boobs and shark film, like, uh, hand in hand. I really want to see Piranha uh, 3 Double D. Yeah. That looks like it should be a classic. The last few months have been pretty intense. Um, I've been hanging out a lot with Iggy Azalea uh, because we're on a song together, which is called Fancy. And um, so we've been doing a lot of stuff with her. We shot a video together, which was this epic, clueless um, homage music video. and. Uh, We've been in America a lot together doing TV and stuff like that, so that's been kind of new for me and very interesting. I did a dance routine on American TV numerous times, which is great. Uh, <laughs> and aside from that, um, I put out a new song called Boom Clap. I just put it online and that's uh, going to be on my record, so that's the beginning of that, I guess. <laughs> Oh fuck, I've gone the wrong way. I'm staring up its ass. Oh, and there's babies down here. They're trying to eat the rocks, don't do it. Mm. Okay, I'm coming out. Boom Clap is um, definitely the softer side of the album. It's, it's like a romantic pop song, which I guess is what I do, maybe, I don't know. Um, but yeah, so it's, it's definitely like the softer side of the record. I've been working with like a lot of different people on this record. I, was, I did some sessions with Rivers from Weezer. I was working with Ross Dan from Vampire Weekend and also with Patrick Berger, who I often work with. Um, so I've been kind of like it's definitely still a pop record but there's like a lot more live elements to it and boom clap is definitely the more kind of sweet softer side of that but there's uh yeah a lot of like the hives influence weezer influence the remotes bow wow wow so yeah broad but like it's gonna be punk it's gonna be cool it's like they're in a jacuzzi it's really weird I don't know, I've just been travelling loads and I've just been focusing on writing a lot. Um, but life's good, it's cool, like Fancy went to number four on Billboard. That's great, that's like the highest, like I love it went to number seven. So that's kind of cool. I won an award for songwriting as well, that was cool. And I made a speech, I never did a, I've never like done a speech before. Um, yeah, I don't think it was good though. I did. I was just like, peace out, Britney Spears is my homegirl or something like really cringe like that. Ah, But um, yeah, life's been good. It's been like, I feel like very ready to put this album out now. I feel, I feel, I mean, everyone says this when they make new music, but I really do feel like I'm writing the best music I've ever written right now. I feel like very confident with myself as a songwriter. <laughs> Like I belong. 
nothing. I think it's just empty. It's really strange in here. Oh, God. I'm looking forward to people hearing this album because it's not a synth pop record, which I feel like a lot of people are expecting me to do, you know? And I, I don't want to just make another... I don't want to make a, like, new version of the record I already, I already made last year. I want to make something completely different. And um, that's what this record is. And uh, even though Boom Clap is definitely one of the more straight-up pop, classic pop songs on the album, like, yeah, there are lots of edges to it. And uh, it's going to be interesting. Some people are going to hate it, but I'm ready for that. Some people are going to love it. It's going to be cool. Do you reckon that's it's vagina? No, they don't have vaginas, do they? They probably do, they're lamorts. I don't know, I don't want to sound dumb, but I have no idea. I keep going through phases where I'm like, it's done, yes! And then I'm like, wait, no, I have to change everything. So I'm very much like, when I'm writing a record, I'm very indecisive, well, indecisive is the wrong word, because I'm obviously decisive because I'm making a record, but I'm very like, I flip between like two parallel ideas and right at the end I'll decide. Um, so I'm kind of still in that phase currently. Um, and I find that I really have to try and like isolate myself from everything else I'm hearing and like everything else I'm watching to just really like focus in on what I'm doing. So I'm currently trying to do that. But it's going to be out this year. It's going to be out towards the end of, well, September, I think. So yeah. I was going to get the style screen.